<laughs> Hi guys, Kami here. Welcome back to Fire Emblem Awakening. Kami, weren't you in chapter 11? Well, fuck me if I was, right? So what happened was, I didn't record chapter 11. I recorded just the ending. Because... I think what happened was instead of pausing the recording, I never started it. <laughs> so, I, what eventually happened... Okay, so, okay, story time with Kami. I was playing chapter 11. The emulator sucks. Crashes a lot. Been able to fix it, so it doesn't really crash that often anymore. But, it kept crashing when I was doing chapter 11. Finally got chapter 11 to work right. Like, I finally got the actual game that's function right and the moment I did uh, you know I, I beat chapter 11 and everything and right as I got to the end I, I was explaining uh, you'll see you in this in this little cut up because I'm gonna tack this onto the start of the episode of chapter 11 blah 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 uh, pretty much I had everything done but I didn't press start recording at all like, I, I, I thought I pressed start recording, and then when it, all the crashes started happening, alright, cool, I'm just gonna pause the recording. Editor Kun doesn't have to edit everything down. So he just has a smaller file instead of like a hour long video instead. So, it is just the end. I am sorry. Uh, best thing I can summarize it in we go to war against King Gangrel, we fight King Gangrel, and this is the end outcome. Uh, other than that, we get Olivia, who is a dancer, every time, which makes it so your allies move an extra turn. That's it. Here's the end of the episode. I'm sorry. Alright. So after... Two or three... Resets... Okay. So after two or three resets... Send that home. We're finally back here! After my game crashed three times, the Citra emulator sucks. But my god, is it the only way to play 3DS games? Oh, oh my god. We are finally done. Let's just finish it with Cordelia. Never mind, let's not finish it with Cordelia because she's not strong enough for some reason. Just kill him, Vake. Oh my god! Finally! Sire. I literally got so sick of doing what I was doing before, I just started rushing everything. And, well, I work, but my god. Order our forces, our, uh, order our forces to cease fighting at once. Sire. Yes, sire. Oh my god. <laughs> I hate everything. And it's finished. Once their messenger delivers our terms, that's it. We put an end to this bloody business once and for all. We won. Somehow I don't feel like celebrating. Victory can be bitter as well, sweet boy. It's good that you learn how. I, 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 don't, I, don't, I can't read. Uh, where's my... I mean, bitter is when those... Uh, let's go to Jelena Grove. Regna Ferex lost many good soldiers today. We need to see to our dead. It's time to attend the living and rebuild our army. Oh, there it is. Forgive me. I'm sorry, Flavia. Your sacrifice will not be forgotten. The leases will compensate your nation in whatever fashion. Please. Oh, in that case, how about you hand over the fire emblem and we call it even? <laughs> Just a little Feroxy humor. Don't worry, our finances, is crumb. Preparations will fail with all the Plegia, and I've seen their treasury. They, they can all, they can well afford it. I can't read. It's pity the men stand between Flavia and Kupo Copper Boy. <laughs> eh, I'll have to remember that when I come to visit. It'll stall. 
Illistol. Yeah, I think is it is it still Illistol or is it Illistol? Illistol, whatever. Captain. Samia. Oh, Captain, you made it. You're safe. Ooh, give these two some room. Hey. Sumia, you're joking me. But... Are you hurt? Ray Steven, you look exhausted. Hey. Rom, say something. Huh? Trying to. <laughs> Flavia, Robin, maybe we should, you know. Oh my. Carry on, lovebirds. <laughs> Robin's like, I'm gonna go fuck your sister. What? Hey, are you... Come on, don't cry. S sorry, I just... No. no, don't apologize. I've been so worried about everyone else well, lately. My sister, our party, my people. It feels nice to have someone worry about me. Especially someone who I am. Someone so... So gifted with Pegasi. Huh? You've been through so much. So many have suffered and died because of my actions. Next to, next to my sister's legacy, I feel like I'm already a disappointment. Wait. That's not true. Everyone fought so hard for you. Why would we all do that for a man we didn't believe in? Thank you. I thank you. I see your point soon. Thanks, Amiya. Oh, we can't read. Oh, you always help me see the brighter side of things. No. Me? You're the brightest thing. Listen. Sumia? Yes? Right. I'm far from a perfect man. I know you could do better. Whenever you're close, you give me strength. So what I want to ask is, will you be my wife? Yes! Yes, yes! Oh, yes! Good. Thank the gods, I was worried for a second because, well, anyways, uh, this is for you. Your ring, it bears the Elysian crest. Bro, oh, I, I can't take this. Hmm. Yes, you can. My parents had it to celebrate my birth. They wanted me to give it to the woman I would spend my life with. Take it, please. And I know I, I will love you until the day I die. Oh, thank you. Bro, oh, thank you. I swear I'll return that love to you a hundredfold. Then I am a fortunate man. I need to ask for a bit of patience for the near future. My first duty will be to heal the scars of war and assume my role for the people. But then, we can begin our life together. Yes. I'll wait as long as it takes. I still hardly believe it. It's, it's like a dream. So much pain surrounds us, and yet... Here we are! About to get it on! A battlefield. I think this is the happiest day of my life! Yes. I feel the same way. Now together we can bring joy back to the royal palace. I'll do everything I can to make the castle a happy home for us, my love. And so the war between Ilse and Plegia has ended. And once again, Kami decided to fucking say Elise wrong. Prince Krom and Robin worked tirelessly to restore Elise's, Elise's splendor. This would be no easy task, for the war had taken a heavy toll on the Helldom. But then for Oxy Muscle and Plegia and Gold, they brought peace back to the people. All the while, the principal swore the title of Exalt out of respect to his late sister. Even so, his subjects grew eager for their new ruler to take a wife. He has a wife. And it is in his heart, Karam had always known who that woman would be. The royal wedding was a joyous occasion attended by thousands from near and far. Finally, it seemed that the last lingering wounds of Elise's history had healed. But then, two years later... There's more war. It's Fire Emblem. Sire. There, a message from Ragna Ferrix. Good. See them in at once. <coughs> <coughs> Fuck, I'm still like in the narrator voice. Yes, my lord. Prince Krom, I come on behalf of Khan Regna Fal Regna 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 Flavia. Flavia, well, this is a surprise. Is something amiss? Right away. I fear so, my lord. The Khan requests your presence at a summit as soon as you're able. Really? What's happened? Oh, fuck. All right. Our western neighbors of Valm are no longer <coughs> acting so neighborly. The emperor, who they named the Conqueror, has launched warships against us. What? An invasion? Are you certain of this? Forgive me. Yes, my lord. The Khan hopes to meet with you in Ferex if it pleases you. What do you make of this, sire? Right. All business. All business, to be sure. Rhyme we'll meet with the Flavia at once. Hi. 
prom. Forgive me. I'd stay with you if I could, Sumia, but we owe Ragnarok's great debt. I must apprise myself of the facts that are there before deciding on a course of action. Yes. I'm not asking you to stay here with me. I'm staying. I'm saying I'm coming with you. Yeah, she's she's not she's not going anywhere. Oh, Lucina is newly born. She needs her mother now. No. Can she not be wet, wet nursed as you and Lissa were? That is how Elise, Elise's tradition is not. Lucina's a strong child. She takes after her father. The brand in her left eye is not only your gift to her. I'm worried about our more than our child. I'm worried about you. That's sweet, but I'm still coming. Uh, um, I know better than to agree once your mind is set, maid. <laughs> well, Sumia really has you trained. Well, what the fuck? Like a whip? <laughs> Lisa, you're not helping. Oh, just promise me you'll return at the first sign of danger, Sumia. Lisa and I had M, of course, but we lost our parents when we were young. I want Lucina to grow up with her family, with her whole family around her. Yes. I'll be careful. I promise. I will ride ahead and assemble an escort, my lord. Mm. Uh, thank you, Frederick. Whoa. I'm quite impressed, Krom. You make a fine ruler. You've come a long way from tending sheep. <laughs> Have I truly changed so much? <laughs> In a way, you haven't. But you've grown as a leader and, of course, as a father. Right. I've tried to do my best. My sister left the Waitley legacy. And all I... I do all I can just to live up to it. I apologize, I cannot come sooner, sooner. Uh, I read that completely wrong. I apologize, I cannot come sooner, Flavia. Hey. What matters is you are here, Krom. You all right? The true Valmy's warships have set sail. What can you tell us? <sighs> Not much more than I'm afraid. The details remain hazy. Just a moment. Oh, oh, where are you, you big ball? Promise here. And it's like, I'm coming! Jesus Christ. Ah, right. oh, well, Melfoy, I knew you'd come. I have someone you'd hear from, I believe you met. He claims to have insight into Vaughn's intentions. <coughs> it's Barf. No, it's Virian. Greetings. Good day, lords and ladies. How fair you all. Allow me the great pleasure and indeed the honor of introducing myself. What? We all know who you are, Virian. Although I don't really believe we've met your companion. You know nothing from her. Prepare for my great unmasking. Long have I posed as archers, archers of archers, yet there was a root but a ruse. Yes, yeah. What? Yeah, an artifice. To disguise myself as a mere above average man, in truth I am. Hmm. May, I present, may I present Duke Varian? I am a humble servant, Cherishy. Cherishy. Cherish. Greeting, sire. You, you honor us with your presence. Cherish, you stole my moment. Well, too bad, Virian. Pleasure, Cherishy. Cherish, I, I'm going to pronounce that name in like six different ways. Perhaps you could speak on your master's behalf. Well, that may speed things along, yes. Good. Like fucking. <laughs> it's like Vander and uh <laughs> and, uh, and uh, what the fuck? Oh God. It's like Olivier and Vander in Trails in the Sky. <laughs> I love it. Uh, and please, time is of the essence. Very well then. First, concerning our origins. We hail from Rosane, a fertile territory in the continent of Alm. The Lord is the head of House of Virian, is the head of House Virian, and the rightful ruler of Rosan. A fact he often reminds us of, of in loudly. Oh, is she not a true wit? She gets it all from me, you know. So what brings a noble in his charge all the way across the long sea? Oh, yeah. Of all means, there was an unremarkable termination once, tiny, almost pitiful so. Other continent all shared its name, you might have almost forgotten it existed. And so Valm might have remained, but not for Walhart the Conqueror. One day, he has taken the surrounding realms into his growing empire. I had no choice but to, ru uh, <coughs> to recruit new allies to aid my people, that's why I've come. <sighs> Blood for your life. More or less, yes. But while my lord hastily gathered his valuables and guided his people out to safety, 
I alone remain to keep an eye on the Balmese crisis. I was there as Rosane was swallowed up by Emperor Walhut's overwhelming forces. Oh shit. Hard. In the end, I too fled here to Regna Ferrix, speaking asylum. Speaking asylum, not speaking asylum. To my great relief, I might add. Eligible women are eligible women are one of Rosane's most precious natural resources. I it would be a shame to waste any, even one who cuts off her lords and ma as I was saying. Yes, yes, all right. I was only a jape. Please, by all means, you may can. So, begging your pardons, perhaps, but perhaps it is time to cut this long story short. Walhart has conquered our continent and now seeks to conquer yours. Huh. Right. He claims to claim the Balmese fleet will be at the shores in a matter of days, and we will soon, will know soon enough if our story proves true. Speak only what I know for true, good people. As does my lord, at least with respect to his this matter. There's that wit of yours again. Ah, <laughs> oh, that wonderful needling chaffering word. Hmm. I believe you both. And Basilio, we must secure your ports as soon as possible. You. you should know that Vaughn has the strongest cavalry in the world. You would want to station troops with experience fighting mounted troops. <sighs> Why, Varian, are you volunteering? And with that, after a long and winded story, we have a new conquest happening. That is the nation of Valm to the east of us, or to the west of us, as you can see on the map down there. That'll be chapter 12. For all that, we got some stuff to deal with. We got the barracks. Dude, we got the barracks, you know, it's just... It be the barracks. I don't, I don't know what to tell you. It'd be, it'd be the barracks. There ain't much happening in the barracks. Cool. But well, we got our wonderful supports. Long Q and Robin. Here for another round. Thank you, but no. I'm still recovering from the last one. I'll say this, I'm glad we're not at war with barracks. I'm far from, and I'm far from her strongest, I mean experience yet raw. Whoa. I find that hard to believe, you're a beast. But I guess you got where you are now by being tough on yourself. No, no just truthful. If you saw what I have seen. If you saw him fight, you would know how far I have to go. Um... You mean Combasilio? Right. This command of his weapon lends it a weight. A uh, depth. I may as well be swinging a feather by comparison. Wing his power, I would not dare call myself strong. I see. But he's given you something to strive for. I'm envious, really. <laughs> you would grow stronger, find a paragon of your own to pursue. Meanwhile, if you wish to spar, you need to only ask. Yeah. I will, thanks. Alright. Crom and Vake. Hey. It's fighting time, Crom. Very well, but on one condition. What? Condition? It's not like you asked for a handicap. Oh. Nothing of the sort, Vake. It's just that... Well, Lissa was pretty upset after our last duel. Poor girl was crying her eyes out. She said we were taking her sparring too much, much too seriously. We made her promise to go easy and to go easy and fight safer, so neither of us gets hurt. Uh, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Last clash was really doozy. <laughs> good times, good times. <laughs> Almost cut off my arm. <laughs> you see this? There's a scar from it. Really cut deep. Uh, but uh, listen, Krom, uh, you're gonna have to explain this fight safe concept to me. Right. I've been pondering that myself. Perhaps we can decide the winner with a coin flip. Oh, gods, no. I don't want Lady Luck picking the winner. Not between us, anyway. Now, if it was me and Kami, that shit goes out of the way. Hey, I got it. Let's say you and me have a good old-fashioned cooking contest. You make something, I make something. We'll see who comes out on top. Really? Well, I suppose that was seldom allowed in the cast castle kitchens growing up. <laughs> ah, you're right. Kicking its royalty would be spe like spearing a fish in a barrel. If I can beat you with honor, I've got no interest in beating you. I will not Hold on, now. I didn't... S I didn't say no. I've roasted my share of campfire boar, and I've heard no complaints. Looks like Teach just got tenure. All right. <laughs> then a cook up it is. Get ready to taste my victory. <laughs> I'm gonna cook up my good old fried chicken. Yes, sir. And with that, we've reached the end of this episode. I'm gonna go here. Ooh, second heal. Ooh, silver weapons. Yes. Silver weapon is the best type of weapon. 
Ah, la, 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 Taking that, taking that, taking that. Sick. And one last thing before we go. <laughs> we got a master seal. We got actually the balloon too. Uh, let me just uh, organize this inventory real quick. Okay, cool. So we have our 11 sword. Or <laughs> 11 sword. We do have 11 sword. By the way, we got 11 sword from, uh, what's his nuts? Uh, Master Seal. We got one. I'll see you all in the next episode, because we're using it on Robin instead. <laughs> see you all then.